എ ഡി ഈസ് എൻ ആൾട്ടിറ്റ്യൂഡ് ഓഫ് എൻ ഐസോസ്ലസ് ട്രയാങ്കിൾ എ ബി സി ഇൻ വിച്ച് എ ബി ഇസ് എ ഈക്വൽ ടു എ സി ഷോ ദാറ്റ് എ ഡി ബൈ സിക്സ് ബി സി ആൻഡ് എ ഡി ഓൾസോ ബൈ സിക്സ് ദ ആംഗിൾ എ വെൽക്കം ടു മാത്തോട്രോപ്പിസം so the first step is understanding what is given and identifying the concept so we have an isosceles triangle abc in which ab is equal to ac we have ad an altitude to the base um, or bc of the triangle it means it's the perpendicular so it means angle adb will be equal to angle adc and it will be equal to 90 degree because it is the perpendicular line we need to show that ad is bisecting bc which means ad cuts bc into two equal halves so it means bd should be equal to bc similarly it also cuts bisects angle a which means it cuts angle a into two equal halves so angle bad should be equal to angle cad this is what we need to prove now when we see what we need to prove and when we see the diagram we can see that the both angles and both the sides are part of two triangles adb and adc so if we can show that these two triangles are similar or sorry congruent then we can show that the angles and the sides are equal so we will take the triangle adb and adc in this if we see from step 1 we have that the angle adb is equal to angle adc which is 90 degree ab is equal to ac and we have ad as the common side now when we think about uh, all the congruency rules with which we can prove the similarity we can see that if there is a right angle a hypotenuse and a side being equal then we can use the congruency rule of rhs so here again we can see that ab and ac are nothing but the hypotenuse we have the common side as the side and 90 degree angle we have so we will be using by rhs congruence triangle adc instead of d we will be writing d and when we see the common side and remove the d part you have both sides a so a will be still similar to a d will be similar corresponding to the vertex d and ang uh, c vertex will correspond it to vertex b therefore triangle adc is congruent to triangle adb once we have proven that these two are congruent then by cpct we can write that the second two side the last two vertices of the similar triangle cd is equal to bd which is equal to half of bc since both are equal then it will be half of bc and hence we can write that ad bisects bc into two equal halves similarly angle bad will be equal to angle cad so it means both angles are equal so ad cuts angle a into two equal halves that's why ad bisects angle a that's shown so forming equations and solving the sum given is an isosceles triangle abc ab is equal to ac we'll keep as equation 1 ad is the altitude so angle adc will be equal to angle adb which is 90 degree we'll keep as equation 2 we need to show that first one is ad by 6 bc which means bd should be equal to dc and second one is ad by 6 angle a which means angle bad will be equal to angle cad now we start with the solution by taking the two triangles adb and adc from one we have ab equal to ac from two we have adc is equal to angle adb which is 90 degree and ad is the common side we know that ab and ac are the hypotenuse since these two angles are 90 degree so by rhs congruence we can write that adb triangle is similar uh, congruent to triangle adc so by cpct we will be writing that the second two vertices taken together bd will be equal to dc which means that ad is bisecting bc into two equal halves similarly angle dac is equal to angle dab so as a result ad bisects the angle a that's shown thank you